Coventry City know they could be 90 minutes away from disappearing out of the top division for the first time since the late 1960s. And already our first stoppage with Darius Vassell, the young England under-21 striker. Victim of a stern challenge and Steve Staunton is already uh, arguing with Paul Williams, the Coventry City defender. Really was a nasty landing there for the young Villa striker. And already uh, a furrowed brow for Aston Villa's manager John Gregory. Now a chance for Marcus Hall to advance. Away from Paul Merson. This is Bellamy. Busy little bee of a figure. He'll be happy with the corner. Telfer with the corner. First of the match. Delaney half clears. Chippo suddenly found an opportunity at his feet. Telfer's ball in right across the face of the six yard box. Just couldn't keep the ball down. Carsley getting the ball away. Space here for Gareth Barry. And that's a rather loose pass to Alan Wright. Eustace has Telfer outside him. Here he is now. Hadji! Coventry City are alive and kicking. Aston Villa caught cold on the break. Excellent cross. Fine finish by Hadji. Dreadful defending by the home side. Look at the space here for the Moroccan. Free header. And it really is game on at Villa Park. Vassell. Game losing out. Williams now. Through to Hadji. Southgate's chasing after him. double that gives Coventry City every chance of three points now today would be a manager Taylor Vassell finding Dion Dublin Vassell then continuing the run he's got the pace to get away from Gary Breen and a free kick for Aston Villa in what for them could be a very important position Kirkland happy his wall is in the right place. And it was in the right place too. Two minutes of added time at the end of the opening period of play. We're into those two minutes now. As Aston Villa look for a way back into the match. And what a time to score it would be for them. Southgate, away from Hall, oh that was close, Southgate sidestepped away from Hall, found Darius Vassell and it was a wonderful opportunity, look for the world like Villa would score there, space for Delaney on this near side, here he is, Queuing up in the middle, led by Dublin, if Delaney can find them. Oh, Coughlin's dropped it! Oh, and Villa could be back in the game! Darius Vassell is there! Delaney was running out of room. It was a tight cross. Oh, and an unfortunate fumble. Goalkeeper really should have had that. Barry. Right. Angel wants the ball. Come a little bit deeper. This is Hendry. Dublin, the furthest player forward. Angel just joining him now on the edge of the penalty area. Villa finding this a profitable outlet on this near side. Their right is Hendry. Kirkland equal to it. The 
Lee Hendry's on a good run of form in front of goal in recent matches. But Chris Kirkland just held his ground and hung on to the ball. He looks like he fancies it today, doesn't he, Ginola? Free kick for the foul by Lee Carsley. Caught as the ball was going. No hesitation there from Mike Riley in putting Carsley into the book. The fourth Coventry City player to go into the referee's notebook today. Merson standing with the ball, Alan Wright as well. It's Merson who will take it. Green got there first. Ten minutes to go. Southgate, dangerous looking cross. And go! Oh, and he scored his first goal for Aston Villa! And it could be a goal to break Coventry City's hearts. And despite having numerous defenders back between Angel and the goal, they just couldn't stop it finding the back of the net. And having been in an exceedingly commanding position, Coventry City now stare relegation firmly in the face. Merson now for Aston Villa. Look at all the blue shirts around him. Here's Angel. Desperate defending. Here's Ginola now for Villa. The pendulum has swung the other way now in this match. Coventry no longer in the ascendancy. Hanging on by their fingernails. Williams with a challenge on Hendry. Coventry have to try and get hold of the ball and throw everything at Aston Villa now. But they have defending to do. Another goal would surely seal their fate. Half clear. Now Merson. A marvellous, marvellous goal by Paul Merson. Gordon Strachan knows the game could well be up now. What a stunning goal for Aston Villa. What an incredible comeback they've had in this match. Two goals down, they find themselves three goals to two up, and Coventry City surely are heading down to the first division. We'll be back, is the cry from the travelling faithful. Coventry's only down the road, down the M6, but it will feel like a, a long trip home tonight. So many people who have come here and hope their team would survive to fight another day. And this surely will be the uh, last few moments of the game. Aston Villa with a free kick. Coventry City's players' body language says it all. They know the game is up. And having at times lived a charmed life among the game's elite in the top division over a period of 34 years, Coventry's fine run has finally come to an end. After ten escapes on the closing day of the season down the years, they haven't quite managed it this time, but they went down fighting here. What a start they made to the match. Two goals from Mustafa Haji gave them every chance of living to fight another day, but Aston Villa came back in the second half, and particularly right at the end, two goals in the final ten minutes, sealing Coventry's fate. The winning goal from Paul Merson.